Portuguese slave trader were not made for Angolian Queen Bundy. The warrior queen fought the colonization and the slave trader for several decades. Uh, queen Zinga of Ndongo and Matamba. Uh, Zinga Mbanda was the queen of the uh, uh, Ambundu kingdoms of Ndongo and Matamba located in the present days of northern Angola. Born in a ruling family of Ndongo, Zinga received the military and a political training as a child and she demonstrated an amplitude for diffusing the political crisis as an ambassador to the Portuguese Empire. See, so she was born in 1583 in Angola and died on 17 December 1663 Kingdom of Matamba. Uh, her full name is Nzinga Bande. Uh, her children is Jinga Mon Bonda. Her siblings Gonda Bali, Makumbu Bande, and Nikifuju Bande. See, her parents are Gwenguela, uh, Kakombe, and Sakombe, and her uh, other parents in Gola, Kiasamba. Uh, so, the water queen fought the concession in slave for decades. Uh, in the 16th century, Portuguese slave trader turned the Congo in South West Africa after the taken slave trader were threatened by the England and France in the northern part of the continent. The most stubborn opposition came from an unexpected source, an Angolan queen, warrior queen, who ruthless maneuvered her way into the power, fought off the slave for decades and rumor that she has immolated her lovers. Uh, Zinga of Ndango and Matamba, also known as Zinga Mbandi, Anna Zinga, Anna Zinga and Raila Ginga, was born in 1583 in the king of Ndongo, a kingdom of Mbongo people in the modern day of Angola. The story goes, here the story goes, that Zinga was named because she was born with a mother in political called rape around her neck, and the Bundo word for twist is Kinjinga. Our channel to spelling of the Zinga is Njinga. This circumstance was believed to uh, indicate that the child will grow to be proud of it. How to? The king Ngola Kiluanji along Zinga and his son uh, Ngola Mbandi to witness his governance of the kingdom, which included numerous guerrilla raids against Portuguese invaders who tried to infiltrate the territory. His children, as a result, grew up with a sharp understanding of the horrific implication of the Portuguese colonization, which depend on the slavery. To expand his reach and riches, according to uh, Lara Sauce, the Zinga face appeared in his historical record in 1622, which arrived in Luanda as an emissary for her brother, the ruler of the town. Um, he had been uh, dedicated all his efforts and uh, forces to keep the Portuguese out of the highlands east of Luanda. During her visit, Zinga converted to Christianity and was baptized as a Ana de Sousa. In fact, I do help her in a later negotiation with the Portuguese. Within two years of his sister visit to Rwanda, Ngola Mbandi had died under unknown circumstances and Zinga has taken her claim as a ruler of the kingdom. Through Zinga was about a revolutionary diplomatic relationship between the Portuguese and Bundu state. She seized her title with a great opposition from the internal politic faction in the kingdom. In the 17th century, Bundu kingdom was made up of the hierarchy of linked political uh, title uh, each with, a, with their own following. After Angola Mbala's death, the king's title would normally have gone to the leader with a combination of the most number of the follower and the most uh, daft political maneuvering. Uh, the scant evidence uh, available in a single place in the general structure indicates that her claim uh, to be royal title uh, of Bengola uh, Kiluanje violated establishing in the Bundu domes. Uh, the Bundu harbored strong feeling against the female assuming any political title and explicitly uh, prohibited any women from assuming the position in Angola Kiluanje. Initially, the Portuguese did not recognize Zinga as a rightful ruler of the Bundu people. Either they suspected that she was somehow implicated in a brother death and refused to honor her right uh, to see him. They said assumed that their parents, their apparent to the Mbundu throne was Angola Mbandi sons. As a result, Zinga was forced to turn support from outside of the state, from a band in Bangala warrior uh, who inhabited the border of the Mbundu kingdom uh, and had expressed hostility against the Mbundu and a Portuguese army in the past. She also offered asylum to slave escaping from the Portuguese territory, eventually recruiting them as a manpower. The Imbangala in, partic in particular were crucial increase in Zinga's position in domestic politics. Not only uh, we the notorious for their fierce ways and how effective 
world strategy, they did not have the same hierarchy structure as Mbundu and the frequent recognized women under the title Timbanza. A leader in both law and politics, Nzinga manipulated the Imbangala's readiness uh, to accept the kinless women as the leader by assuming the Timbaza position in a group of the Imbangala led by Kaza, one of the most powerful warlords in the region. The Bundu recognized Zinga's situation with the Kaza as a marriage of the soul. Uh, and so did Portuguese, according to the Miller, uh, Zinga then used uh, the Kaza help her or uh, kill her brother's son. Uh, the here apparent in effort to secure her position as a leader in the Bundu. However, eventually the Imbangala left in Zinga and defected to Portuguese due to her lack of the Imbangala assessor. Uh, by 1629, Zinga was left without allies with the Portuguese army in hard pursuit. She fled to the old Bull kingdom uh, of Matamba, uh, a safeguard that had in recent years been revealed by Portuguese in the Bangala reign. In 16th century, Matamba had flourished under the rule of the several queens, although they had long since ceded rule uh, to Zinga's father. Ngola Kiluanji and the later brother, and uh, later her brother, the disarray after his days in various raid had created a political vacuum which Zinga was quick to fill using the willingness to accept the female rulers in, uh, in Bat, uh, Batrace her position as a leader of the moon. Zinga increased her wealthy, her armies and her power by blocking the Portuguese axis, the slave route uh, dividing, dividing the slave into Matamba. She continued resist Portuguese. She continued to resist Portuguese troops. Well, in a letter 60, in a late 60, he said that she would wear male grace and lead an army into battle for herself. Uh, legends of Nzinga extended outside our brilliant military taxes and political strategy. Uh, uh, Nzinga immolated her lover, immolated her lovers, obtaining a late all male harrowing after she became queen in having each man she slept with killed after the carnal encounter. Mm. Though there were no way of knowing if there is truth to this rumor. There is no denying Zinga was a ruthless ruler and afraid of sacrificing men who came in her way. In 1657 at the age of 74 Zinga entered peace treaty talks with the Portuguese and after having fought and been thrown down by the colonial enslaved raiding attack for decades. After considering much of her power, Zinga devoted her effort to rebuilding her war town nation. Following her death in 1663, the Portuguese lost their most valiant opposition and they were able to accelerate the colonial occupation. Uh, Zinga, Mbandi, and Angola independence until came 20th century. She had in a lot of respect. Not much has been written about African writer or the African history revolutionist. But during the Angola fight independence from the Portuguese uh, 1970, an MPLA leader named Manu Paravira wrote a novel about Zinga called Zinga Mani uh, while imprisoned by the Portuguese, drawing, drawing many parallels between our fights and ongoing civil war. The spirit of uh, Raina and uh, Ginga is not dead. It serves as a source of, inspira source of inspiration and pride to the people and its leader who face new challenges and pride and the people its leader who face new challenges and pride. Uh, Angola now is independent and the statue dedication to Zingas in Luanda saved as a tribute to one of the first people who fought uh, for his freedom. Uh, so, Also, a question which has been asking frequently uh, how the Queen Zinga sterilized her brother, then ordered her and some of her sisters to be sterilized and mixed her with herbs, was uh, thrown while boiling onto the uh, bellies in her sister so that from the shock, fear, and pain she should forever be unable to give a baby. Zinga never did, Zinga never did have another child. Uh, now, how did Queen Zinga uh, mean? In, was able to keep balance the Portuguese of uh, to keep Portuguese of the balance because of her association with her late father. She could speak Portuguese and write as well. This also gave a lot of leverage. She succeeded negotiation, negotiation, a peace treaty. Okay, so what did Queen Zinga also use for a chair? 
in, uh, in an often repeated tale, the Portuguese governor, Correia de Sousa, did not often, did not offer her Queen Zinga chair to sit during their negotiation. Instead, uh, had a floor met laid out for her to see. The use of the banner floor or mat was appropriate only for uh, subordinates and, and Zinga took exception for his slide by the governor. Uh, Zinga increased her wealthy, her armies, and her power by blocking the Portuguese access to the slave route and diverting the slave into Matamba. She continued to resist the Portuguese tr troops while in her 60s, he said that she would wear male dress and lead her uh, and the lead the army. So, man, if you face time to this program, please just come, uh, go to subscribe to the platform and share the video to a lot of people if you enjoy this type of video or which type of video you want me to make and please do a little donation is a little uh too small to help us to do more research thanks a lot for your time follow me instagram and twitter thanks and peace in the mouth